Hey, g'day folks, it's Joseph Talbot here, a real estate broker from Southern Georgian Bay, Ontario in Canada, a beautiful location to move to. Um, so today I thought I'd take you guys for a quick tour on the cheapest homes that I could find in the sort of the uh, Georgian Bay area. So basically Simcoe County, um, it is a big area, but um, I basically typed in uh, my maximum price will be 500000 and all this information you can find on Realtor.ca. It is public information, so it is available to you. Um, however, if you want more information, uh, by all means, get a hold of me. Um, anyways, so basically, i take you for a real quick tour here. There's not too many homes uh, for sale in the area in that range. So basically, here's one, here's one up in Aurelia. Uh, it's a three-bedroom, two-bathroom. It's a story and a half house. Not a very big lot. Um, doesn't really tell me what size the lot is. Um, let's see here. But it is 1,212 square feet. So that's for both floors. So that'll be about 600 square feet per floor. So there's that one. Here's another one. This one's in Aurelia as well. It's listed for $499. Um, and it is a two-bedroom, one-bath house. And again, it, it is a one-and-a-half story. Actually, it's more like a... It's got a very sloped ceiling on the second floor, so it's limited. It's basically a, a channel down the center of the uh, house that you get. You don't get the full square footage upstairs. Uh, just trying to see what uh, if it says how many square feet, and it doesn't. But anyways, that's uh, you know if you watch the video, there are there are some videos that might give you a bit better of a tour. Look at the pictures, and then uh, you know you can always give me a shout. Uh, another one I looked at here, this one's in Wasaga Beach. It's a cottage. It's listed for $459. It's a two-bedroom, one-bath. It's just a three-season cottage, but you could upgrade it to a full uh, four-season cottage. And it's it's actually on a, a reasonable size lot. It's not a big lot. It's uh, 71 by 105. It's actually listed the size of it. Um, I like when realtors do that. Um, another one here, this is uh, 85 Sydenham in Angus. So this one here is a bungalow. It's two bedroom, one bath, and it has a full basement. I think this one said it did. And uh, yeah, and uh, backyard doo, 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 doesn't really give us the size of the lot. It just says under half acre. I really like it when realtors list the size of the lot. This one here is uh, 869 square feet. So you can't get a mortgage on that. You need most mortgage companies want to see greater than 800 square feet. Uh, and one more, one more here. We have another little wee tiny bungalow, two bedroom, one bathroom. Um, and again, I do not see, oh, here it is. Yeah, 835 square feet. So yeah, you could get a mortgage on that. Um, well, it depends on the condition of the house. I'm just I'm just saying general sense here. Um, so when you, when you guys are, are going to be, just a piece of advice here. So if you're looking in the, in the under 500 range, which is very rare these days, there's not a whole lot in that price range right now. So you got to be ready. So when you're looking, you got to have, you got to have your mortgage in line. You've got to be all uh, pre-qualified. Um, some mortgage brokers would say, oh, I don't quit pre-qualify people. That's nonsense. You can, you can get pre-qualified because you have to know how much you can afford before you can go start looking at houses. If you, if your mortgage agent says, oh, I can't qualify you or uh, pre-qualify you. There's 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 stipulations and, and conditions within that, but nonetheless, you need to know how much you can spend. No point in looking at a $18,900,000 house if you can only afford 429,000. So, and, and if you only got, you know, if you only got like $10,000 deposit or a $50,000 deposit, you're not buying a, an $18 million property. So that all comes into play. So make sure you're ready, ready to go. And, and a lot of times you're going to be in competition whenever it comes to purchasing these cheaper homes. So whether you're an investor, whether you're a first time buyer or, or retiree trying to downsize and uh, pull some of the equity out of the home that you have now, there's lots to consider. So by all means, give me a shout or DM me or message me or go to my website. There's a link right there for, for Joseph Talbot uh, website there. Click on it. You get to the contact easy there. So anyways, that's your scoop. That's your uh, wee tour for today for the cheapest houses that I could find in Simcoe County. So, which is a pretty big area. And if you're looking to move in other areas, there are cheaper houses if you go further north. And I'm talking way further north, you, you know, north of North Bay and Sudbury. Um, so, anyways, until next time, enjoy your day. And again, it's uh, Joseph Talbot, real estate broker in Southern Georgian Bay area. So, until next time, take care.